I have gathered from my recent trip to the tribal areas where I had some uh, meetings with some rather high profile uh, militants and uh, they they were pretty much obsessed that uh, what they call it huruj in Pakistan. Huruj means revolt and revolt means that it would be uh, pretty much different from their previous strategy uh, like uh, isolated suicide attacks. Revolt means that they would they would they would be a surge, a serious surge in Pakistan. I was standing in the stage when the Quran started to start with the Quran. At that time, there was a shock. When I saw it, people were falling apart and falling apart. Al-Qaeda today is very much restructured. Compared to 2006, it is very much restructured. They have formed the committees like military committee, like the religious committee, like uh, coordination committees and they have established independent cells all over the Pakistani cities and each cell doesn't uh, know the whereabouts and the nature of other cells and they have recruited local Pakistani boys, the former members of the Hadi organizations and they actually put in place a system of recruitment. They interview and they screen a particular person and then they uh, allow him to join their ranks. They have an agenda to carry out specific plans to create chaos in the country so that I mean, people would come out on the street and they would take advantage from that situation and bring and materialize their plans. What I have gathered, you can call them sort of Islamic anarchists. They have a plan to destroy the refineries and the water and power projects so that people would uh, agitate and they would take advantage of the, that situation. Al-Qaeda is obsessed to disrupt the electoral process uh, scheduled on February 18. And so are the independent groups I have mentioning. Uh, I've been mentioning about uh, that uh, they are also aiming to uh, disrupt the election process. Osama bin Laden approved the plan after the Lal Masjid operation, Red Mosque operation in Islamabad. He appointed a meal for Kuruj in Pakistan. This is a, the most recent development. I see it as a serious threat.